But according to the game, we have solved all possible fates on the ship. So does this mean we can leave now and I won't get a shitty ending? <laughs> is, that a, is that a thing? Possibly. Oh, I better leave this uh, memory now. Okay. It's my first day. <laughs> it's not, but uh, let's say it is. <laughs> let's say that it is. There we go. It's my first day. <laughs> I gotta get the uh, sound uh, sound redeems working again. I don't know why they're broken. I'll look into it. I will look into it. Right. Oh yeah, maybe I can check it by going. Hang on. Do 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 do. Advanced audio properties. No. Nope. All right. I'll have to look into that. Um, I'll have to do that after the stream. Right. But let's leave. Um, I think I can leave the ship. Oh, hang on. We have one a whole entire chapter left, right? So, but I can't get it unless I solve. Unless they're solved in the last chapter. So I think... I think we can leave the ship and not get a shit ending. I think. Uh... Oh well, I guess we can always rewind if we fuck up again. Alright, farewell Oberdin. We're gonna disembark. Uh, hope the goat's alright. <laughs> Don't know where he went. He's somewhere. Rip in peace everybody, we're going home. Alright, peace. <laughs> you do get the complete insurance assessment now. Oh, okay. Eh, fuck it. I get money. Who cares? <laughs> this is insured for a lot. We should I... go. Oh. Storm's nearly about, so we won't be coming back. Eh. Alrighty. Uh, oh, we can go back if we want to. What the fuck? Did everybody die? Uh, no, actually. We have four confirmed survivors. We do have four confirmed survivors, actually. Um, let's see. Yeah, we've got... We got some living people. I don't know where they are though. Here we go. Alive in Africa. Alive in Africa. Alive in Africa. Oh, and where's the surgeon again? Uh, alive in Africa. There we go. So we do have four survivors. Um, oh, actually, we might have more because we're still missing two people. Oh. Oh, here we go. <laughs> there we go. Close up shop there, sailor. Hey, this guy's got animation. I didn't even notice that. <laughs> this guy's real, unlike all the other people. <laughs> Sit down, you idiot. Alright. This guy actually has animation in him, unlike everyone else that's in, like, a freeze-frame memory. I guess I move as well, uh, but I'm just hands. I'm just hands. I'm like hands from Spongebob. It's fantastic. Right. I think we did relatively okay-ish. I'm only half an hour over. That's not bad. Only took me eight and a half hours to figure this out. <laughs> Maybe that's good? <laughs> All right. One week later. <laughs> oh dear. The Honorable East India Company Insurance Assessment for the good ship Oberdin, victim of calamitous events at sea, prepared by the Company Office of Investigation. Okay. Uh, ship was damaged uh, and sunk. Okay, it sunk in the storm. Oh, I see. 20,000 pounds, cargo gone, 5,000 pounds. Let's see. More cargo. 3,000 pounds. Multiple cargoes. Captain uh, killed himself after murdering a crewmate. Four of them. Estate forfeited to the Crown. Attempted mutiny. Estate fine $25. Theft of cargo. Estate fine $100 for Edward Nichols. Oh yeah, the murderous dickhead that he was. Martin Parrott. Uh, unknown findings of merit. Extraordinary valour. Exceptional performance of duties. Estate awarded outstanding wages and reward of £90. That's a lot. John Davies, fourth mate, clubbed in the face by Henry Brennan. Uh, murder of crewmate one, estate fine 15 pounds. That's, that's not too bad, I guess. Uh, let's see. Alfred Klessel, torn apart by a beast, findings of merit, exceptional performance of duties, estate award, outstanding wages of 70 pounds. Charles Minor, uh, torn apart by a beast, criminal findings, murder of crewmate, estate unknown, expense claimed, $15. Um, it was accidental. I'm pretty sure I made it look accidental. Oh yeah, I guess you can't really make anything an accident in this game. Ooh, handles. I know, handles are the best. Oh dear. Ship handles. Henry Evans, surgeon. Fate alive in Africa. Findings of demerit, abandonment of crew and vessel. Estate award and outstanding wages of 50, 50 pounds. That's not too bad. James Wallace, surgeon's mate. Decapitated by beast. Uh, findings of merit, extraordinary valour. Estate awarded outstanding wages and a reward of 50, 50 pounds. Okay. Uh, Winston Smith, carpenter. Spiked. <laughs> findings of merit, extraordinary valour. Oh yeah, he blunderbussed the fuck out of a spider dickhead. Uh, a crab bastard, yeah. 
Spider Crab Bastard. Uh, estate awarded outstanding wages uh, and rewards £60. Marcus Gibbs Carpenter's mate. gets He only gets £30, though, even though he was... Yeah, he was great. Estate unknown. Outstanding wages donated to pension fund. Great. Uh, Thomas Sefton, the cook. Struck with a tail. Estate awarded outstanding wages of £40. Emil O'Farrell, spiked. Findings and merits. Exceptional performance of duties. Estate awarding outside of wages and reward. Uh, he was the butcher, yeah. Uh, Christian Wolf, the gunner. Shot cannon, beast. Findings of merit. Exceptional performance of duties. Estate awarded outstanding wages. And reward of £70. Olus Weirter, gunner's mate. Shot by gun, J. Davies. Criminal findings, murder of crewmate one, attempted mutiny. <laughs> Estate fine, £50. Duncan McKay, purser. Drowned, beast. Findings of demerit, abandonment of crew of vessel. Well, he paid for it with his life. Estate awarded outstanding wages of £50. Uh, Finley Dalton, the helmsman. Drowned by beast. Estate awarded outstanding wages of £30. We don't give a shit that he was <laughs> at, at the wheel at all times. What a fucking trooper. Edward Spratt, the artist, crushed by beast, uh, a state awarded outstanding wages of £50. Abigail Hoskett Witterall, passenger, fate, clubbed, beast, no claim made. Nunzio Pasqua, oh, he was the Italian uh, guy that was murdered. Uh, knifed by E. Nichols, no claim made. <laughs> He's Italian, you don't need no money, it's okay. Emily Jackson, alive, Africa, criminal findings, murder of crewmate. Oh yeah, she shot the shit out of uh, Leonard. Uh, findings of demerit abandonment of crew and vessel estate find £35. James Bird, oh, only find £10. She didn't do no wrong. Alive in Africa, findings of demerit abandonment of crew and vessel estate find £10. Bun Lan Lim, passenger clawed, no claim made. Oh, yeah, because we don't know anything about the form hosts. Burned, criminal findings, murder of crewmate, estate unknown, expense claim £25. Uh, Chiotan spiked criminal findings, murder of crew Mason. Yeah, but he was a prick. <laughs> Estate unknown. Expense uh, 25, claimed uh, 25 pounds. Hock Seng Lao shot, gun, H. Branham, no claim made. Oh, we didn't even mention that he was executed. That's right, we couldn't do that, so that's interesting. Because they would have fined the shit out of him if they could find his estate. Uh, Zhang Ji Sarthi. Are you Hercule Perrault or Benoit Blanc or Sherlock Holmes? A mixture of all three. <laughs> I am, I am investigator insurance man. He was executed for a crime he didn't commit, I know. Poor Hock Seng Lao, he didn't deserve to die. Zungi Sarthi, ship steward. Oh yeah, that was the guy that was shot by, uh, by Charles Minor. Yeah, state awarded outstanding, wa outstanding wages of £35. Philip Dahl, the captain steward, fate unknown, criminal findings, murder of crewmate. Oh yeah, he, he um, yeah, he sorted the leg off of, uh, uh, Pete, didn't he? Findings of demerit, failure to perform duties, the state fine £35. You really fucked up on your duties there, buddy. Paul Moss, first mate steward, uh, killed with a sword by L. Volkov. Yeah, I think he was killed by Leonard. Findings of demerit, exceptional performance of duties, the state awarded outstanding wages and a reward of £45. Okay, that's interesting because Paul was murdered by Volkov in an attempt to hop on the vessel and try to abandon ship. So, because he never abandoned ship and was stabbed to death, despite his intent, his estate is still awarded money. <laughs> it's like, uh, it doesn't matter if he tried to escape. He didn't. He got stabbed. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Samuel Galligan. Oh, he's the Irish guy. Yeah, second mate steward. Knifed uh, by, by CR. Uh, criminal findings. Attempted mutiny. Theft of cargo. Estate fined £50. Roderick Anderson, third mate steward, crushed by a cannon, estate awarded outstanding wages of £10. Davy James, fourth mate steward, uh, live in Africa, findings of the merit abandonment of crew and vessel, no claim made. Interesting. Peter Milroy, uh, midshipman, um, exploded, findings of merit, extraordinary valour, estate awarded outstanding wages and reward of £40. You get £40 for blowing up, that's extraordinary valour. Fantastic. Uh, Thomas Lank, uh, knifed by Wyatt. Oh yeah, he was the one who was stabbed in the back. Estate awarded outstanding wages of £30. Charles, this is going to cost us quite a bit of money. Uh, the Queen ain't going to be too happy. Uh, Charles Hirschstick, midshipman, burned. Findings of merit, extraordinary valour, exceptional performance of duties, estate awarded outstanding wages and reward of £50. Omid Gull, topman. Oh yeah, he was cool, he had a sword. Fell overboard. Findings of merit, exceptional performance of duties, estate awarded, outstanding wages, and reward of £35. Timothy Butement, Topman. Shot by gun by... Yeah, yeah, Nichols shot him. He was the guy with the tattoo, right? 
Finding of Merit, Extraordinary Valor, Great Frumpy Waifu Tattoo, uh, Estate Awarded Outstanding Wages and Reward of £35, Huang Li, oh god, the top men are here, Electrocuted, Findings of Merit, Exceptional Performance and Duties, Estate Awarded Outstanding Wages of £35, Decapitated by Beast, same deal, £35, uh, Speared by Beast, Criminal Findings, Attempted Mutiny, Theft of Cargo, Estate Find- Oh yeah, Li Hong was the top man that went with the, uh, with, uh, Nichols and his lot, so yeah. Wei Li, Drowned, Beast. Uh, Extraordinary Valor, Exceptional Performance, Duties, £45, alright, nice. He Drowned by Beast. Wait, how did Wei Li drown again? I forgot how he drowned. Oh yeah, he was grabbed by the Kraken, that's right. Nicholas Bottrell, Speared uh, by a Beast, Estate Awarded Outstanding Wages, £25. Yeah, that's not bad. Marva, oh that fucking guy. Torn apart, uh, yeah, was he ever. Findings of merit, extraordinary valor, exceptional performance of duties, estate unknown, outstanding wages, and rewarded donated pension fund, forty-five pounds. Lewis Walker, the topman, clubbed by uh, the captain. Oh yeah, he was the guy with a knife in his mouth. Criminal findings, attempted mutiny, estate fine, twenty-five pounds. Leonard Volkov shot by Emily Jackson. Criminal findings, murder of crewmate, estate unknown, expense claimed, uh, fifteen pounds. Ah, oh, we'll just take that. Money in the bank. Alarkus Nikishin. Uh, Claude. Criminal findings. Attempted mutiny. Theft of cargo. Oh, that was the guy that was clawed by the mermaid. Yeah, whatever did happen to all those mermaids? They kind of buggered off. The, the kraken buggered off. The crabs were killed. The crab bastards. Alexei Toporov. Seaman. Drowned. Beast. Criminal findings. Attempted mutiny. Theft of cargo. Estate unknown. Expense claim. £50. Nathan Peters. Drowned. Beast. Criminal findings. Murder of crewmate. Findings of demerit. Abandonment of crew and vessel. Yeah, that's what you get. £25, dickhead. That's what you get for clubbing uh, a Dane in the head. Lars Lind, there he is, seaman. Uh, clubbed by N. Peters, estate awarded an outstanding wage of, uh, wages of £15. John Naples, uh, who was he? John Naples killed... Oh, he was the guy who got his leg cut off by F. Dahl. Findings of merit, exceptional performance and duties. He took that amputation like a champ. Estate awarded outstanding wages and rewards, £25. Renfred Rajub, the seaman. Uh, illness. Oh, he was one of the guys who died of illness. He had the lung disease. Estate unknown, outstanding wages, donated to pension fund, £15. Abraham Akbar, crushed by beast. Findings of merit, exceptional performance and duties. Estate awarded outstanding wages and reward of £25. Oh, what 8 a.m. stream? W 8 a.m. stream? Oh my god, hello there. AKA Minini, how you doing? <laughs> Is it 8 a.m. over there? Oh boy, what's the time here? Nearly 6 p.m. William Wasson, crushed by cargo. Findings of demerit, exceptional performance and duties. Oh, he was the one that was crushed by the mermaid, wasn't he? State awarded outstanding wages and reward twenty-five pounds. Solomon Syed, he died of illness. I remember him. Outstate, uh, state awarded outstanding wages of fifteen pounds. How many more left? Oh, only a few more pages now. Hamadu Diom. Oh God, that guy took way too long. Spiked findings of merit, exceptional performance of duties. Uh, unfortunately, the human shield he tried to use didn't work out too well. A state unknown, outstanding wages and reward donated to pension fund twenty-five pounds. He was a bit of a bitch, though. Um, Henry Brennan. Oh, it's Hat Boy. Mr. Clubby McGee. Knifed by the captain. Finding murders of crewmate one. Attempt to mutiny. Estate fine. 50 pounds. Alexander Booth. Uh, oh, he was the... Yeah, he was the guy who died on the... On the escape vessel, didn't he? Yeah, findings of demerit. Abandonment of crew and vessel. Estate warded. Outstanding wages. Five pounds. He was, uh, KSI. <laughs> Patrick O'Hagan. Oh, the Irishman that was speared by the, uh, by the mermaid. Criminal findings, attempted mutiny, theft of cargo. Well, 8.39 to be exact. Yeah, it's 6.39. Oh, sorry, 5.39 for me. It is not 6 p.m. <laughs> it is not 6 p.m. How you doing though, AK? Hope you're well. Uh, we've only got one more chapter to do. I'm just reading through my uh, my claims here. Seems like we're doing quite well. Uh, George Shirley shot by a cannon. Okay, so he was shot out by a cannon. I couldn't find his body, but he was blasted to oblivion. Findings of merit, extraordinary valor. He turned into bits like an absolute pro. A state awarded outstanding wages and reward of £25. Samuel Peters, crushed by cargo. A state awarded outstanding wages of £15. He was the guy who died first, right? A pre preliminary draft of this assessment has been approved by the Royal Trait Guarantor. 
Total claimed £29,285 on behalf of the Honourable East India Company. I certify all statements are as accurate and declare this matter closed in its entirety. Please don't sue me. H-E-H-E-I-C, Chief Inspector. Signed with an X. There we go. <laughs> Signed H-H-N-R, uh, what's this, like, Andrew Garfield. <laughs> hey, we did a thing. The pocket watch remains in your possession. He was executed for a crime he didn't commit. Poor Hock Seng Lao. Right, let's send the book back. The book returns to its original owner, Henry Evans, in Morocco, as requested. Ah, oh, they said that in the bad ending too, didn't they? I should have known. Well, I've been awake for almost 24 hours straight, so I'm fine, I guess, for now. Oh, boy. Well, thank God we're at the end of the game, pretty much. You could use some sleep by the sound of it. But we do have one more chapter to do, so... We only have two people to identify, so it shouldn't take that long, right? One year later. Oh, I'm back again. Hello. I got my tea. There's no more tea! I want my tea. Oh, oh no. The tea's all gone. I'm so sad. Fuck you! Fuck you! <laughs> oh. What's happening? Nanny, what's happening? Br Bring me some more tea. If there is no tea, I shall break your legs again. Ooh, I've got candlesticks. Oh. Oh. Let's go indeed. Oh. Smells just dreadful. Yeah. You don't open it inside. Why does it smell dreadful? I'll be turning in now. Yeah. Tea's in the kitchen if you need more. Hey! There's there's not a lack of tea this time around. Yay! The good ending means you get plenty of tea in the kitchen. And also we we get more than just a letter this time around. We get a whole package. Let's see. Uh, I can't read any of that. Let's see. Something about London? When you do well, she leaves tea on the stove. When you got the shitty ending, she says there's no tea left. It's like karma. If you do a shit job, it's like, no tea for you, sir. <laughs> Go fuck yourself. Chief Inspector, I hope the letter is better this time around. I write to you with the unfortunate news that Dr. Evans has passed away. Oh, he succumbed to his illness shortly after receiving your package. <laughs> package. He was very pleased with your correspondence and asked that his gratitude be expressed by returning the book to you along with the means to complete it. He's like, okay, you missed two people, but I think you can figure out the rest for, me, for yourself. It doesn't seem terribly miffed that I didn't finish it. Uh, as for the three of us that remain, the Obradin is a distant memory and a dreadful trap chapter in our lives that we we wish to forget. Do not write back. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> Regards, Jane Bird, uh, etc., etc. All right. There we go. So we got... Uh, oh, that's the letter. Uh, we got the book. Okay. Oh, this tale belongs to you now. Please finish it. H-E. All right. Henry has sent us the book back again. Is there anything new here? Uh, escape in the lazarette. How can I check the lazarette for the final chapter if I'm not on the ship anymore? Hmm. I've done everything else, haven't I? The only crew members I don't know anything about right now are Martin Parrot. We don't know anything about him. And Paul Moss? No, Philip Dahl. Okay. Those are the only two I don't know anything about. Um, so that's weird. So the game's like, ah, it's fine. <laughs> you can't get these two. I, I'm guessing you can't actually figure these two out on your own. Uh, all right. So do I need the book for any reason? Don't know. Check your drawers. What am I supposed to do now then? How do I get back to the ship then is the thing. Oh, hang on. What's this? I got another present. What's this? I hope it's a new oak pipe. What is it? The fuck is that? Oh my god, it's a severed hand! Um... Uh, Nanny, there's a severed hand here. I think I found out what was smelling up the place. <laughs> it's a monkey's paw. Oh yeah, it doesn't really look all that human, is it? Oh! Oh, is this the pet monkey on the ship? He was riding the goat, and oh, and he was on Henry Evans' shoulder as well. Those are the only two times I remember seeing him. Was he in other scenes? Oh, I might have missed out on important monkey scenes. Oh, I remember him riding the goat during the uh, execution. Is this the same monkey? I assume it is. Okay, got a monkey's paw. Ah, 
Uh, we're using the severed monkey's paw just like we're using the severed legs. Oh, I see. So the monkey knows something that we don't. Ooh, okay, let's find out then. Let's go. We will de we will delve into the Obra Dinn one last time. Here we go. <laughs> Psych, got you. Now nah, we're going. Here we go. All right, we'll go. There we go. <laughs> All right, here we go. I forgot that that's a thing. That's funny. Nope. Is this the ship? We need to go. Right. Hmm? What are you up to? Well, you up to? Nothing good. Oh shit, what the fuck happened? Where the fuck are we? We're back on the ship, I guess. Oh, we're in the lazarette. I recognize the open doors here. Oh, okay. How did we get through the locked door though? What what is going on here? Monkey got shot. Why did you shoot Monkey? Is that- that's Henry, isn't it? Yeah, that's Henry Evans. We already know who he is, though. Who was he talking to? Uh... Let's see. He was talking to... Oh, Paul Moss. Oh, he's dead. Wait, no, he's- yeah, he's the one who died, isn't he? Who's the one that's still alive? Yeah, where's- where's, uh, where's Davey? Oh, but this would have maybe taken place before that. Wait, I'm not done! I gotta check Monkey! Oh, no! <laughs> shoot him! Oh no, I didn't get to check anything. Uh, the monkey. He wanted to give us access to the lazarette, so he shot the monkey to give us a body part to see this. Oh, because the door was locked. Oh yeah, there was a lock on the door and we couldn't get inside. Oh shit, okay, so he tied a rope around the monkey, threw him in and then murdered the fuck out of him, so he could then bring him back in, cut off the monkey paw, give it to us and then we can use the- Ah, uh, because that's where the monkey died. He threw him in the lazarette to die so that we could go back and actually- Oh, that's fucking genius. That's fucking genius. It's like, well, we can't get in here. Uh, can we find something? Uh, yeah, the monkey will do. Yeah, we're just gonna fucking kill the monkey. There we go. Bring him back in. Cut the paw off. There we go. Now we can use the, uh, we can use the, 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 the watch. I forgot what it's called. It was Latin. Uh, <laughs> we've got the pocket watch and now we can see where we're going in the lazaretta friendly but not entirely pleasant monkey companion was sacrificed in the pursuit of knowledge oh no oh poor monkey oh f's in the chat for poor monkey san he's dead he's dead he's just fucking dead there you are collect your things wait where's the key to that door gone damn there's no time we need to go right in you go what are you up to nothing good <laughs> two others were present there was Henry Evans, and there was Paul Moss. Okay. What did we learn from that, though? I don't think we really learnt anything. Location of corpse in the lazarette, so we finally made it. Okay. Oh, but wait, there's more. How many chapters do we have in this one? Part five. Oops, ah, I fucked it up. Bargain. How many are there? Oh, <laughs> there's the monkey paw. Oh, I should have a look at all of them, actually. I should have a look at all the little pictures. Loose cargo. It's loose cargo. <laughs> a bit of cold. A cattle skull? Oh yeah, we uh, started that chapter by yeah by seeing the the cow die. I remember now. We have murder. Oh the the chest with the with the uh, with the shell in it. The calling. There's the shell. <laughs> of course, unholy captives. Uh oh, that's the ship's deck with the yeah with the net on it and the yeah right the blood and everything. We found all of them. Uh, yeah, that's where yeah, that's where they all were brought in after they were all dead. Soldiers of the sea. Ah, oh, yeah, we got the spear and the sword. Very nice. We've got the doom, where we've got a kraken up to no good. <laughs> we've got escape with a lifeboat, and we have the end, which has a gun in it. That's right, I remember that. But now we're on bargain. He's got a monkey's paw. <laughs> oh, that's macabre, but I like it. Okay. Um, so... What are we supposed to get out of this, though? Oh, shit, there are other bodies here. Who's this? Who's... Oh, it's Philippe Dahl! Oh, we found his body! He, Of course he was locked in the lazarette. Of course he is. Okay, well, we found the, the captain's steward. He was locked up. Um, He looks pretty dead. I don't know if he's dead or wounded. We'll find out. Um... All right, he's got a mug of ale. Oh, is that the chest with the, the shell in it? I'm guessing so. Is there anything here? No. 
There's a... What the fuck is that? Is that a sword embedded into this place? Oh no, rip monkey. He got fucking blasted. Look at that shit. Sorry, monkey. You gotta go. Fucking blammo. <laughs> he just got fucking blammo. Oh dear. I hate to see it. He's dead. There's one dead monkey. Oh dear. Have I got a gunshot? I think I've got a gunshot somewhere. Where's my gunshot? Uh, I don't know. Where's my gun? I, I'm sure I've got a gun. Where's gun? Here we go, I've got a gunshot. <laughs> Monkey dead. <laughs> Alright. Oh, there's another dead body here as well. Oh, is this Martin? Oh, that explains why I couldn't find the fucker. There's Martin. There we go. He looks like he was spiked to death. Uh, can I mark that in then? I don't know how, uh, Philippe died yet. Yeah, these are the only two we need here. Martin Parrot and Philip Dahl. Uh, yeah. That's third mate. Oh, I can't figure out his fate until I actually see it. I forgot about that. Um, alright. Let's go then. There's not too much left to do now. Uh, what am I looking for? Uh, Am I looking for Martin? Yes, there we go. Alright, Martin's up next. Once we've figured out how he's died, um... Yeah, there's only two left to figure out. A third shell! Hmm. Captain didn't toss them all! Leave it! Help me lift this! Hmm. Oh my god. Well, set whom free? Give it the shell. Do it. Oh. Oh, they caught a mermaid, Scott. didn't they? In the net. The and brought it aboard. Throw it over. Oh. Lock the door when you leave. Oh, that's why it's locked. Get the tail, boy. Oh. Yay. <laughs> it's a floppy fish lady. With six booba. Oh. The ship. Okay. The Uberton. Yeah. See it home. Wait. <laughs> oh, he's gone. All right. What's going on here? Oh shit. Okay. Yeah. There we go. So he got spiked by a mermaid by accident, I would say. Uh, that's Paul, I believe. No, that's Davy James. Okay, so these are the survivors, and that's... That's Paul, but unfortunately Paul didn't make it. Uh, yep. Oh, yep, we gave her the shell. Right, we'll give you the shell, and we'll get you to leave. Where are the other ones? Weren't there, like, three of them? Or four of them? Or maybe it was just two of them. I'd lost count, actually. Still don't know what happened to, uh, Philippe there. Maybe spiked as well. The spikes all over the fucking place. Alright, but there we go. There we go, we've sorted some things. Right, what are next then? There we go. Oh yeah, well we can finally seal the deal on this one. Finally figured out what happened to Martin. Bloody hell, he's been gone forever. Alright, Martin Parrish, third mate. Uh, he got spiked, didn't he? He got uh, spiked by a terrible beast. Terrible she was. So many titties. Alright, we just have to figure out what happened to Philip Dahl then, I guess. Which I'm guessing we're going to find out now. Nope. Mermaid? Oh, shit. What the, what the fuck is that? Uh, well, something died in there. Oh, is that one of the mermaids? Oh, that's one of the mermaids, I think. What the fuck happened here? What the fuck is going on? Oh, if I had a nickel for every time I heard that one. Oh, shit. <laughs> Is that the captain? I think that was it. Yeah, yeah, that's the captain, all right. <laughs> oh, that's where the sword went. <laughs> Stab the shit out of the mermaid. Oh, there's the shell. Here we go. In exchange for freeing the mermaid, the mermaid would send the Oberdin back. This is the namesake bargain that drove away the Kraken. Oh! Not early enough, unfortunately. Oh, no. <laughs> was the captain even aware that his wife was dead at this point? That'd be pretty fucking depressing. Probably found the body and said, I'm going to take her to my quarters. We also have... Oh, he's got a shell. He's... I... He might be dying. 
Oh, dead already? It's in a different position. Oh, they had to get the shell from him, didn't they? All right. Here we go. What are next? The la in the lazaretta, captured beast fought against its jailer and was spared for the speared for the trouble. I'll kill everyone, every last one of you monsters. One other person was present. Uh, I was just the captain. <laughs> okay. All right. I don't think we have to solve anything there because we don't care about mermaids on our crew register. What happened to Philip? Oh, another mermaid death. I guess I'm all right with that. Spare the titties. You can actually see a glowing shell in the distance when we're back in the Obra Dinn. Oh yeah, I noticed that. Oh. I thought that was like someone just spying on me from a distance. <laughs> oh dear. Oh no. Uh, he shot the other one. <laughs> he shot the other one. Kapow! Get rid of Kraken or I murder you all. Oh, and there's where the last one is. Uh, yep, Philippe's still dead. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, no more mermaids. Uh. No, I'm <laughs> I'm a sorry. <laughs> okay. All right. I don't know what we're supposed to do here. We still can't tell how Philippe died just yet. I thought that was just uh, someone spying on me, like Guru. Ah. Okay. I guess we're just seeing the story play out now instead of actually solving deaths now. Although we still have to find out how Philippe died. Oh, it'll probably be in part one. An unholy creature's defiant shrieks were greeted with a fatal bullet. <laughs> Call it off, damn you! Alright, I think we have one- yep, we have one more part to go. Boom. Scan a sombre time. Oh, we're gonna find out what happened to Philippe Dahl at long last. I wonder how he died. He's just sitting there with a shell. What's happening? Trying to break out, maybe. What's this? Quicksilver. Huh? Oh God, what happened? Oh. oh shit, what happened to him? My <laughs> God in heaven! Fuck! Oh no! What happened to your boy? Oh shit! Oh right, yeah, you did the same thing that um, uh, it 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 Ben sang what Sai, whatever his name was. Why, why the fuck did you put your hand in it? Not a good idea. You burnt your hand off, didn't you? Look at you, you fucking idiot. You burnt your fucking hand off. <laughs> you see that big ass hand you got there in your in your picture? Well, now you don't have it anymore. <laughs> he tried to get the shell out for some reason, and then yeah, burnt himself. Well. At least we know what happened to him now, that's good. And that solves the entire mystery. That was pretty easy. The sounds of him getting locked in. Hmm. Or maybe even breaking out of restraints or something. Okie dokie. Well, that's that's pretty easy. He just burnt himself the same uh, the uh, the same way as the Formosan fella did. So that's easy. Philip Dahl, Captain Steward, met an unknown fate. He burnt to death. Hey, there we go. Well done. All fates correct. Yeah, we did it. Oh, all 60 of them. Fucking hell. We did it. Yep, Martin Parrot also solved. Oh, yeah, give me all those notches. Yay, we did it. <laughs> we did a thing. Good job. Good job. We solved everything. If I had the time, I'd go through the entire series of events in order. Maybe I'll do that at, uh, on another stream, maybe. Maybe I'll just play through the game and just, like, watch all the events play in sequential order. That could be good. I don't really have the time for it right now, though. I'm an hour over. i got to end a stream. But, there we go. We've finished that tale, I think. Are we done? Make a video of it. I could do that. Yay! <laughs> Yay, we did it. Give me that fucking shell. Why, does the sh why do the shells shine so brightly that they actually have motion? I never got that either. Oh, all right. Coolio. Oh, there's the door that we leave out of. Well, goodbye, mermaids. And Roll Dahl. You're dead now, but... <laughs> yeah, Martin was locked in. He's fucking dead. There we go. Alright, well... Why was he locked in, actually? Oh, oh, I'm gone. <laughs> why was... I guess he just went in of his own call. Maybe he wasn't locked up. Uh, well, I think we can say that this case is closed. Oh, I've got a diamond. 
There we go. Oh, I wear my gloves even when I'm not investigating. Oh my god! That's a game, I think. I think that's a game. Is that a game? The end! <laughs> we did a thing! Oh, we did a thing. Is that it? Hey, there we go! <laughs> Shit! Well, Lucas Pope- oh, for my dad as well. <laughs> Lucas Pope is now two for two now. If he makes another game, I'm going to buy it. <laughs> I like both of his games. Oh, remember he cut off a dude's leg earlier? Yeah. Oh, I know why he was thrown in, but I, I, I wonder why Martin was in there. That's what I was wondering. I remember why uh, F Philip was uh, thrown in there, but... Eh. Japanese localization? Oh my god! <laughs> you can play this game in Japanese. Oh my god! Hey. Maybe this is what happened to the crew of the Mary Celeste, eaten by a kraken. <laughs> I wonder if you can beat the game by, like, making all of the fates bullshit. Like, everyone died from dysentery. <laughs> everyone got ate by a kraken. Uh, which is believable, frankly. There we go. Oh, here are all the voice peoples. Jesus Christ. Oh, but, uh, did somebody voice... Wait, some, some characters didn't have voices, did they? Of all 60 characters, there are people that didn't have a voice. Oh, and some people voiced multiple people. Oh, would have liked to have been in this game myself. It's just, hello there. You got a bit of dysentery, have you? It, what the? F is that a giant spider crab? Oh, <laughs> oh fuck! Oh. oh dear. Oh my goodness gracious me. That's quite the game. I'm surprised we actually completed. It. I mean, I went an hour over my eight-hour stream time, but fuck it. I I was worried I would have to do a stream on Thursday. Oh dear. Oh, there's the Italian violinist who got stabbed. What a fucking terrible situation. So many people died. The waifu died. So many waifus died. Oh my goodness gracious me. Oh, at the end of the day, at the end of the day, let's see, 56 crew members in total died and, and one starway. So that's 57 people in total dying. Are we going to say that the cow is people? Are we going to say the monkey is people? Probably not. <laughs> Monkeys aren't people. Well, not going to lie, I was a bit worried there at certain points. Oh, uh, yeah, I feel like I got lucky sometimes. I, feel, I felt like I got lucky. I, the, the, sh the shoes was the worst part. That was the worst bullshit. I'm glad I noticed it. I noticed the socks and then I was like, uh, I can't see the socks. Oh, but the shoe is distinct on this guy. And then it was just like a toss up between the last two anyway. Those Chinese topmen, what the fuck, man? Chinese asshole! I know. <laughs> this is the worst. All got a nasty dose by sleeping with the loose mermaids. Oh dear, so many multi-titty wanks. Good times. <laughs> Six boobers, you can have a lot of fun with that. You can have a lot of fun with that. I know I would. <laughs> oh, Christ almighty. Oh, that was... Quite an excellent time. <laughs> oh, there's the credits. Oh, there we go. <laughs> we did it. Oh, hang on. Let's change the colors so we can... Hang on. Here we go. Oh. Yeah, let's go with the IBM. It looks like sunset. There we go. That's the return of the Obra Dinn. Good shit. I like it. <laughs> and this is uh, prep for next week's stream. Where we'll be doing pirate stream. Oh my god. Now, because we've already done all of the Lego, the Pirates of the Caribbean uh, uh, episodes, uh, we're done with that game. Uh, which means we'll probably have more time to do more um, uh, thingy, uh, Sea of Thieves. Um, so, if you've got that game and you want to join the crew, I'm sure we'll have some openings there. If you're on PC or Xbox, because there is cross-play. That is certainly something we can do. Um, but there's also other stuff we'll be... We'll be doing as well, because we usually do a bunch of games, a pirate stream. I, I had a feeling this game would need its entire- it wouldn't- would need an entire stream though, so I decided to give it its own one. But there you go! Gearing up for pirate stream, it's gonna be a grand old time. Trade wins! Uh, do I even have that? I don't know. Oh dear. Alrighty, that's pretty good. Look at that ship sailing. Oh, well PlayStation, we can see if these is there now too. Oh, do you think there's cross-play with PlayStation, Xbox, and PC? That'd be pretty fucking handy. That'd be great. Oh god, this game fucks my eyes. If I look at anything white, it just looks kind of pinkish. Oh, okay, not the best on my eyes. 
I think so. Hey, there you go. So just about anyone can play. If it's on the Switch, it probably isn't, but you could probably play it on that too, maybe. I don't know. I think there's only spots for like four crew members though, but yeah, I think we can get a full crew in if we're lucky. I think so. Oh boy, so what is there to really mention before we find someone to raid and close out a stream? Um, nothing really. There won't be a Thursday stream. Um, I'll pick a later point in time to maybe play this again. Maybe I'll do it on Pirate Stream if I have time, where we'll just go through the entirety of this game. Uh, go through all the, the little, uh, the little, uh, yeah, the whole story just in, in chronological order. Oh, not getting me on Sunday, unfortunately. Oh dear, that's a pity. Um, although, interestingly enough, Thursday for me is the 19th, which is Talk Like a Pir International Talk Like a Pirate Day. <laughs> so, um, I might do a Thursday stream next week. Play Concord. Ah, uh, you can't. <laughs> it's gone already. It's dead. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't think I have trade wins yet, but uh, I might look into it. I might see it. Oh dear. I put trade wins in the suggestion bow box. Oh dear. Um. Yeah. Uh, let me think if there's anything else I have to remember before we go. Um. <laughs> Yeah, I gotta remember things. Uh, we're doing pirate stream next week. I will probably do a Thursday stream as well. Yeah, and oh yeah, I could do uh, I could do um, Sid Meier's Pirates because it's on the 19th. I won't have to change the date, so we can get all the pirate talkings. That'd be great. And then I could also probably do all of the story. And I mean, we're not doing investigation, so it might take like an hour or two to do all that. Can't do Wednesday either. That's all right. Alrighty, there you go. There's Return of the Obra Dinn. That's a thing. Hey, <laughs> let's get some music going and some waters. There you go, there's waters. <laughs> there we go. That's Return of the Obra Dinn done. Dusted. <laughs> let's find someone to raid before we go. Shall we raid someone? Let's find someone to raid. Um, here we go. What will our raid message be? Uh, monochrome cheek. I know, yeah, I monochromed all of it. Actually, it matched uh, the, color, the color of the background. Look at her dance, she's so happy. Um, alright, what will our raid message be today? Um, um, I don't know. Um, oh, how about, um, uh, uh, there we go. How about this? Kind of silly, but we'll do it anyway. There we go, unless anyone's got a better idea for a, a raid message, I don't know. Here we go. That looks kind of fan dabby dozy. There we go. There we go. And I'll do one for uh, non subscribers as well while I find someone to to raid here real quick. It is taking a while to load up for some reason. Why is he doing that? <laughs> uh, Twitch raid. Uh, where is it? There it is. I don't like typing it in because it takes so long. There we go. Maritime Mystery Ahoy! Alright, let's see who we're raiding today then. Uh, we've got some people, so I wonder if, um, oh hang on. Yep, Shmar is live. I wonder if anyone has any less viewers. Uh, no, we'll just, we'll just raid Shmar. Some people, so, hey, it's me! <laughs> Shut up, me! Okay, uh, yeah, let's raid Shmar. That should be good, I think. Alright, so we're gonna raid some Shmar, should be good. So there you have it. We did it. We solved the mystery of the missing peoples on a boat. <laughs> it was an enjoyable time, I suppose. Nice stuff. Um, yeah, all right. Um, I probably won't do a Thursday stream, so tune in next week. Oh, I'll do a plug. I'll do a plug. Why not? There we go. Ah, hang on. Well, at least Gibbot works. Be sure to follow Gib Gaming on other social media platforms. There we go. Discord. Fantastic. And there you have it. That is a stream. Tune in next week for the official Talk Like a Pirate Day stream of 2024. It's going to be absolutely piratical. You're going to love it. I know I am. Oh dear. So more, more seafaring stuff on the horizon. Oh boy. You are not going to want to miss it. But hey, that's it for Return of the Obra Dinn. It's a good time. I enjoy it. I highly recommend it. It's fantastic. So yeah, there you go. That's, that's a thing done and dusted. So thank you very much for joining me. For Return of the Obra Dinn, I've been me, you've been you, I hope you've enjoyed the Maritime Mysteries, and I'll see you when I next see you. So until then, be sure to not lose your boat to some hentai!